The way we design buildings is outdated. It takes too long and it's too expensive. But what if we had a better way? What if a computer could help us design buildings faster, cheaper, and even better than architects can? Well, it's not a dream anymore. A new tool can generate building blueprints instantly, and it's already being used by some of the biggest companies in the world. Let's take a look at how it works and what it means for the future of architecture. First, let me tell you about the old way of doing things. When an architect designs a building, they have to start with a blank canvas. They need to consider the size and shape of the lot, the local building codes and the client's budget and aesthetic preferences. Then, they have to sketch out the floor plans, elevations and details and make sure that everything is to scale and in the right place. And if there are any changes along the way, they have to go back and redo everything from scratch. It's a slow and tedious process that requires a lot of skill and experience. But it's also very expensive. The cost of labor and materials is constantly rising, which means that construction costs are going up every year. And that's why many companies are turning to AI to help them design buildings faster and cheaper. Now let's see how the new tool works. It's a web-based platform that uses artificial intelligence to generate building footprints in seconds. All you need to do is enter a few parameters such as the building area, the number of floors, the type of rooms, and the style of the facade. Then the AI algorithm takes over and creates a set of floor plans that meet your criteria. You can then choose the one you like best or use it as a starting point for further customization. The AI can also generate 3D models, sections, details, and other documents that you need to build your project. But what's amazing is that you can make changes to any of these documents and the AI will update everything automatically. For example, if you decide to add a bathroom, it will add it to the floor plan, sections, details, and 3D model without you having to do anything else. It's like having an army of architects working for you 24-7, always ready to make changes and adapt to your needs. That's why this tool is so valuable for architects, engineers, designers, and builders who want to save time and money and still get high-quality results. One of the first companies to adopt this technology was a major tech company. They were building a new campus in a major city, and they needed to design several buildings, including a circular office building, a rectangular data center, and a triangular cafeteria. Using the traditional method would have taken months and cost thousands of dollars. But using the new tool, they were able to generate the blueprints in days and at a fraction of the cost. The results were so impressive that they decided to use the tool for all their future projects. Another company that has benefited from this technology is a major real estate developer. They wanted to build a mixed-use development with residential and commercial spaces, and they needed to optimize the design for both functionality and aesthetics. Using the new tool, they were able to experiment with different layouts and configurations, and find the best solution for their site and their budget. They were also able to get feedback from their clients and make adjustments accordingly. And all this helped them to reduce the time and cost of their projects while improving the quality and satisfaction of their clients. This technology is still in its early stages, but it has the potential to revolutionize the way we design buildings. As the algorithms improve and the databases grow, we can expect to see more innovative and complex designs emerging. We can also expect to see more collaboration between humans and machines where architects and engineers work together with AI to create the buildings of the future. What do you think of this technology? Do you think it will make buildings better and cheaper? Or do you think it will replace architects and make them obsolete? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to learn more about AI and its applications, stay tuned for more updates. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.